Somehow, somehow I really feel like I'm forgetting something. But, I don't think I forgot anything. I don't know. Sorry that the game is not as wide as it should be. Uh, I, was, I was trying to mess around with the settings, but but for some reason, I, I have a 2K monitor, which is 1440, not 1080, but this will not go any higher. And and for some reason, when I have borderless windowed, it doesn't put it to the same aspect ratio as before. So uh, bear with me a little bit for that. But what's up, Leviathan? Thank you for the lurk. I see you and Echo with the yo, welcome in, welcome in. Now, we left off having explored everything on the island. And if you'll look, there is a little more that maybe there wasn't there before. So this map was always a lot bigger than the the developed portion already now i heard that if you go down into ember valley there could be some kind of an update what's up adriana welcome in so we're going to be exploring a little bit down there i want to see there's some new tech available as well i i love how much better the uh, the jump pack is than before also we're we're stuttering a little the graphics on these slime rancher games early access has always been a little bit odd um, but that should be okay. We'll, we'll bear with it. So it looks like we have another heart module, which I don't need another power core. Haven't seen past streams of this. Honestly, I have no idea what this game even is. Oh yeah. Okay. So slime rancher is a really cute game. It's by Monami park and it's just, it's just cute. I, I, I really like it. I mean, I know we've done a lot of half-life since we moved over to YouTube, which I, personally really love but honestly when we got our start on twitch we did a lot of slime rancher that was kind of one of the big ones we did a lot of smaller indie games we did a lot of stuff that was like really chill really calm and i just i think we're we're getting back to our roots a little bit here so uh let's let's get some pink plorts and then let's get if we can get some primordial oil going i think that would be awesome um other than that I think, yeah, there's two more uh, slime things. So I don't think we need to feed any of our slimes. They're looking like they're fine. They're all happy. So why don't we just go off and explore a little bit? I do see a call coming in as well, which we had exhausted all of the calls before. So let's see what Thora has to say. Thora is so adorable. Hey, B, I know it's silly, but I worry about all the hard work you do out there all on your own. So I sent you a little care package. Hope it gives you a little extra get up and go. Aww. Thanks, Thora. We got a little bit of extra get up and go from her. She is a wonderful woman. Thora West, good stuff. Okay, so we're headed to Ember Valley, which if I remember is this section. Right? Oh, wait. Can't tell if those are rocks or clouds. Those are cloud. Uh, those are rocks because the clouds move. So I think this is Ember Valley. If not, I don't know where we're going. I didn't read or look up a ton of the new update either. So kind of going in blind. I know part of me is like, you should have prepared for this. Uh, we don't need Jellystone. We need Primordy Oil. And I think the best way is to go to this far teleporter. So the aspect ratio mixed with the color palette is very odd it is and i i should warn this game is in early development so if you don't want spoilers for the finished product probably not the best streams to tune into uh slime rancher one i remember buying i think i played it before i started streaming or something like that and i was like this game is so good i'm gonna wait until it comes out and then i'm gonna stream the whole game and i did and it was super super cool so Definitely happy with that. I sent him my Tesla for an upgrade. So I keep getting these notifications that the doors are unlocked and the, the trunk has been left open and all that stuff because they're doing a bunch of stuff to it in the shop. But yeah, that's kind of exciting. I swapped out the suspension or rather I asked my mechanic to swap out the suspension. It was something that I was fairly confident I could do myself. I didn't want to have to buy all the tools for it. All right, you guys. Nope, that's that's T. I meant to press R. Wow, the the tar is really explode now. Also, one water drop kills so many tars. All right, are they all gone? Can the music change back? Man, the resolution is really messing with my brain. 
it's I it's strange that it limits it to 1920. So between between streams this week, I'll have to look into why it's doing that. I'm hearing tar music again, but I don't see any. This area is really notorious for getting full of tars because there's just so there's just so many things out here. Maybe I should have brought some food. No, okay. So I heard there's a new hen type. Type. There, there's a new type of hen. There is a new two types of slimes. And there's an entirely new update to the zone. Let me see on the map. Ember Valley. Okay, so we're headed in the right spot. Now, all I know is that there's a secret entrance to somewhere in Ember Valley. So I'm going to try. I'm going to go to where that temple was that looked like it was sealed off. And I'm going to see if that is where they developed the new area. You gotta look up where the teleporter is because it was too hard for you to find. You can tell me where it is if I'd like to, if I'd like. Okay, so let me, let me get through here real quick. And then if I, if it's not where I think it is, uh, then absolutely you could tell me. Definitely appreciate your input, Levi. Uh, I'm going this way. Look at all these chickens. Holy cow. That's, that's a lot of chicken. A holy chicken? I don't know. Okay, it's not in the magma cave. That would be a weird entrance to a cold biome. Although not the weirdest. It Okay. Now this might be weird, but somehow I feel like it's in one of these little spots because I remember there was a weird lighting glitch where light would shine through walls strangely, and there were a couple walls that seemed like they were definitely doors. But we'll see we'll see what we got going here. That was the map. Now, I was just going to go look over here. There's no fall damage, but it still gets me. Like, I try to I try to feather the boost instead of taking fall damage. Which, again, there's no fall damage, but still. Geese are terrifying creatures. Look at all these chickens points to a field of geese. Yeah, geese. Oh, field of geese would be super scary. Okay, so it's not right here. There's just, like, one magma guy chilling over there. Oh, we haven't read this journal yet. This must be a new one. Accessing gg.log. This gate is sealed too, so I must really have been the first to enter since it was abandoned. We have read this. It was here that I had my first doubts. I thought I was talking to the engineers, problem solvers, people who could fix what I found. But once we were left, once we left the labyrinth to meet up here, I saw they were smiling. They were excited at the opportunity. The company had sent their sent their money people, not engineers. I don't think they had even considered stabilization. It wasn't long before it all collapsed. And then here's the archive, the secret. We had to make a decryption key for this. And here we are, back in Ember Valley. The labyrinth must wrap around most of the island. Jeez, how long was I even in there? Next time I'm definitely bringing lunch. And an extra fork. In any case, I need to rest up and head right back in there. This is starting to feel like a truly amazing scientific and historical discovery. I need to make some calls. So, this is interesting. He left his fork in there. I'm wondering if that'll come back as an Easter egg. Also, I'm realizing that the bright ones are the ones that we haven't found. Okay, so if it's not there, uh, maybe up around the lava flow area. Let me let me think about this a little bit. There could be something up here, or if this counts as Ember Valley, there might be a teleporter right here, which you wouldn't really think of doing. Um, I think that's probably, we've been up there before and it was really hard to get to and it felt like it was not intentional game design. So, let's head over to this way. See if maybe we can get there from the beach. Oh, we should pick this up, right? Lava Dust is the rare one. We'll, we'll throw it away. Um, we'll throw it away real easy if that's not the, that's not what we should be doing. Would you like to know the general area? Yeah, hit us with the general area. That would be good. A tall magma clump. All right, I'll take it. 13 treasure pods. So they added some more treasure pods too. Because even in the... Oh. Where are the tars? They must have been below us. Wow, this is so cool looking. It sounds so cool too. Oh, there's more... 
fire stuff. Uh oh. How do we get up there? There's a log up there. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, there's the tars. Okay. I don't have to deal with those tars though. Just gotta recoup my energy. I don't think they'll attack us way up here. I saw something. Oh, it was one of those. Okay. Um, how did we get up there before? I think we like jumped onto these trees. Oh, no thanks. Okay. Okay. Let's just stay on this bush for a little bit. This is fine. It's in the northern part of Ember Valley. That's up here. Maybe way up here? I don't know if this is also Ember Valley. It's, I wish, I wish you could zoom out and they would show you the names of stuff on the map. Cause I thought Ember Valley was just literally this Ember part, but, um, we'll head to the north. That's fine. There are so many Tars around here. It's, it's pretty crazy how many Tars there are. That guy's just chilling. Look at the magma spilling over too. Oh, the sound. The entire island is Ember Valley? Okay, yeah, see that? I, I'm i glad you said something then, because I would not have known that. I would have just been going around the Ember part. Um, Can we make this? Yeah, we can make it. Easy. Makes sense that it's up over that way, though. So, let's see. Is it faster, you think? Um, well, we might as well get more of this. I'm thinking Primordial might be the rarer of the resources. Ow! He bit me. He could have blown up, but he bit me. Super rude. Okay, so we're headed back towards this area. I was thinking it could have been past here. Like, there, it seems like there's a lot of opportunity for... Um, for hidden secrets around this area. But, also maybe not. There's There were so many tars that way before. Let's go up to this hot spring looking area. Uh, this seems like you could easily put a secret back here. In fact, I don't remember this being a thing. Is that primordial oil? It is. I will take all you've got. There were only two. That is super disappointing. Maybe the top of the waterfall? Oh man, this is so cool. I really missed Slime Rancher 2. I, I wish, part of me wishes that we would have hot hit this in, uh, like after it was developed, but I, I could not wait. I just couldn't wait. And uh, yeah, this it's so cute. Oh, you know what? We need more water. Perfect. No, that's not the way. Okay, we need the super geyser. Please stop messing with my friends. Let me out. Okay. I love the waterfalls. I think they added some. This looks so cool. So that's the teleporter back home. And this is about as northern Ember Valley as you can get. So. Oh, more primordial oil. I will go get that. In fact, I definitely don't need the lava dust. But it's whatever. Now that. I almost died. That was close. That area. Oh, ooh, okay, okay. Hold on a second. Hold on. That looks like snow to me. So we're looking for a teleporter somewhere around here that'll get us up over to the snow. So maybe this is a good candidate for it. Let's uh let's let's ride around over here for a minute. Amazing. Let's see what we've got going on on this side. Oh, Primordial, right by the teleporter. That's nice. In fact, where does this drop us off? Because we could go back and drop these in the resource collector real quick. Hmm. We've gotten that log already. Aurora Borealis, yeah. This game is so pretty. Okay, if it's not here, then where would a good place to put it? Maybe down in this area or up in the 
Yeah, we'll just we'll just keep going all around this area. I, I love re-exploring, so. Oh, Half-Life referenced. Aurora Borealis. I didn't even realize. I missed a Half-Life reference. I'm losing all my street cred out here. Okay, let's think about where a teleporter location would be. Where even are we here? Okay, let's keep going on the falls this way. See if we can find something. Something going on. It's just a bad joke. Let's just get as high as we can. I remember there was this too. It's like the both and. This is so pretty. Dude, we can just hang out like in this waterfall. Imagine it was behind the waterfall. That would have been so cool. They really made this game a lot prettier. I mean, seeing the lava falls over there, seeing the waterfalls here, like this little tiny part that's both lava and water. How cool. It looks like they made this area walkable as well. I see all these bees nests. I don't think we need them for now. But it's good to know that they're here, because I usually roam around the other side of the island. Over there. You could see it from here! Oh, this game is amazing. I love this. I kind of hope the teleporter isn't up here. It very well could be. But, I mean, that, that's kind of a long way to have to go up here every time we want to teleport. You know? Maybe they'll give us a shortcut. I think we can make it up right here. No, we cannot. Okay. Then that's definitely not the way. I gotta not jump off and die too, because then we'll have to go all the way back home. Oh, this game is so cool. It's so cool. There's a tar. Oh, I'm shooting lava dust. Rip. Well, at least we know where it's gonna hit now. <laughs> Glad I wasn't shooting the primordial oil at him. Okay, let's roam around up here for a minute. Wow, it carried the momentum with it. That was cool. Maybe we can see a teleporter from up here. Or maybe it's inside the rocks. Okay, if I was a teleporter to a snowy island, where would I be? I might be in the bat cave area. I think there was some kind of sealed door here that we couldn't unseal. So maybe we'll head over that direction. Like with the areas uh, being bigger than they were done at Solar Ash, where the other areas are just 2D when you aren't there yet. Yeah. It might be down there too. What's down there? In fact, that looks like a teleporter right there. But okay, so it could be down there. But let's keep going this way. So if you're wondering why I jump around a lot, um, it's not always bunny hopping. The jetpack only lets you go so high from where you started. Ooh, that looks really cool. Wait, did I miss? Oh, we got to go down into it. Can I get in there or am I going to die if I jump down there? I mean, it, it sure look. Oh, a rock gordo. That's got to be it, right? This has to be it. Let me let me feed him something. I need a veggie. I need give me some veggies. I need veggies. For my friend. Wow, they're just like spawning from the ground. Oh, there's this door too. This was the door I was talking about. But it doesn't even look like we can get there. We need, what, a magma plort? So we need a magma plort and a bunch of heartbeats. And then we'll come back here. And it did mark it on the map. So that has got to be the secret entrance. Let's go back home. We'll pick up 15, 20, 30 heartbeat. That's a strange diamond. I'm taking that. Come on. Um, we need, well, here's, here's some heartbeats. 
We'll get heartbeats. We will get... I can't even get out of here. I don't know if it was worth jumping down there. No, it definitely was. Strange diamonds are rare. So it's nice to take them when you can. I love that you get six, uh, six vacuum tanks in Slime Rancher 2. In Slime Rancher 1, it was just four, and I was always hurting for more. Like, I always needed more. So definitely appreciate having six. There's so many quality of life updates. It was the same with Subnautica. Like, you guys, maybe you were here for the Subnautica streams over on Twitch, which I would love to play Subnautica again. So I'm just kind of waiting until it's been long enough that I can play it again. Um, the second one, so Below Zero. I keep wanting to call it Sub-Zero because that's like, isn't that like a Mortal Kombat character? Sub-Zero. Our slimes might be hungry, but we have exploring to do. Sometimes you need to let your slimes be hungry so you can do some exploring. That is, uh, not my calendar notification. Okay, we've gone the wrong way. We need to go the other way. But, now that we're up here, I think it makes it easier to get over there. Absolutely does. Cool. Come on. Okay, we're good. We'll go home. Heartbeats and a magma plort. We just need one magma plort, one heartbeat. And we need to not fall in and die. I suppose we could have just fallen off the edge and died. But I would have been real sad if we lost our strange diamond. And we only have 40%. We don't have 60% um, keep on death, so I don't know what it would do with just one. Or maybe it randomizes what you get. Maybe it's like 40% of it all, but it might be all of the primordial oil. It might not be. Okay, so if we are magma, where would we be? In the cave with the bats? I think if I remember correctly, that's where we put them. Okay, so we get some heartbeats from... Where do we have our rock, guys? I think we have rock anglers over here. So heartbeats should be over here, yes. Our magma guys. They're so cute. Everything in this game is so cute. I'm honestly glad that we picked up those six. Because if we need to feed the big rock gordo 50, then that's going to be... We're going to need them all. I guess we could take other veggies with us, so. Yes, this is exactly where they would be. And I need one. <laughs> all right. I'm coming for you, big Gordo guy. Should we take other things with us? To maybe prepare for something? Maybe? Like if we pick up a whole bunch of fruit? We'd need to make 50 fruit, though. If I remember correctly, we have way too many mint mangoes. So we can probably take 50 mint mangoes, unless my storage cap is 40. Rip. Uh, maybe we'll find some of the upgrade plans while we're out. No, I have more mint mangoes. Let's. I'm gonna take 50 fruit with us just in case, and maybe I'll also take a bunch of chickens. I told you guys we had too many mint mangoes. Okay. Uh. We can take some pogo fruit as well, because I doubt mint mangoes are going to be the favorite. And I, again, I don't know if you need 50 or 40 to pop a gordo. If it's 40, then and they're both fruit gordos, then we're set. I have a feeling one's going to be a meat eater, because we've seen sabers in the trailers and in the marketing, but we haven't seen them uh, yet in the game. So I'm pretty excited. I'm hoping sabers are in here as one of those two mystery ones. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Look at all these chickens. We picked up 40 and it barely left a dent. Look at all of them in the wild. What is happening with our chickens? Dude, that's nuts. 
There's so many they're like escaping. Oh, and we have all those uh, those nectar things too. We never did bring back any butterfly guys. Okay, this is fine though. We don't have any more calls. I know we should probably sleep. And we should have probably picked up 40 other types of hens, but it's fine. Infinite chicken bug? Uh, well, I, is it a bug confirmed? I feel like they boosted the rates. I feel like they purposefully boosted the chicken rate. Because it used to be really low. Like, even if you had them in a coop that was max upgraded, they would still, like, die out over time. And I think they just boosted them, um, so that that wouldn't be a concern. Because it's a bummer when, like... You spend, you spend a lot of time making sure that you've done everything you can, and then you just can't breed chickens. You can grow fruit, you can grow veggies, but you can't breed chickens? I don't know. It seems like they boosted the rate so it was kind of on par with the other ones, because man, it was annoying trying to breed chickens in Slime Rancher 1. Another treasure. I'll take it. Yeah. Okay, if we go down through here... That's fine, right? And then we go back up. Yeah, that was fine. We should pick up more water. Are we past the water already? <laughs> we should pick up more water, he says, before the tar music starts playing. It's like I've played this game a lot or something. Where are we headed? We're headed to Big Gordo Guy. Kind of wonder what's down there, but once we go down there, there's no getting back. So, I don't know if it's really worth it. Okay, we go this way, and then to the right. Then we need to go up, right? Can we get to it through this cave? I don't know that this is taking us to the right spot, but we can always jump down. Wait, we were just in here. Okay, we went the long way around, apparently. That's going to be something. You can tell. You, you can tell this is definitely going to branch out to somewhere. But they haven't, they haven't done anything with it yet. Which to me is just so exciting. How did we get lost again? I think it's because we need to go up that way. Let's see if we can fly there from here. It might be too high, but I think we can make it. Oh boy. Oh, it was so close. We made it. It's all good. The strange diamond sparkle. Probably should have slept so that, uh, like, slept a full 24 hours so that some of the resources respawned, but it's all good. We're going to a new spot. Okay, so we needed one magma port, which we have. I don't want to miss. Oh, we needed two magma ports. What's that? Oh, we needed three. Dang it. <laughs> Alright, we'll do that another time. For now, I'm gonna fill up on water. And we're gonna get this guy going. Nope, there's no water over here. How do I get up there? Okay. Uh, oh. More heartbeats. Pretty sure I need to get up in there, though. How do I get up there? How did we get there before? Okay, we can probably jump up there using the coral, right? If we stand on top of this, then we stand on top of this, then we stand on top of... We'll just keep going this way. All right, now we can definitely get up this way. Oh, my guy. Okay, so if we have 11 left, then it's 40 each. It's 50. Yeah, it's 50 each. Wow. Also, that wasn't the spot. This is just an air blower. We've already been up here. Oh, that's kind of annoying. And Leviathan, thank you for not saying anything, because you definitely knew that wasn't the spot, and you let us go down that road anyways. But it's part of the adventure. Ooh, jetpack drive. Upgrade the Vax jetpack. That was worth going because I missed that treasure somehow the first time. Okay, so if that's not the spot, maybe over here? 
Maybe it is in this cave? Or maybe we need to go back home, get two magmas, and then open this door. I have a feeling that's what it is, which is a little bit annoying. Yo, I don't have very much water left. Stop being Tars. Alright, we'll go get two more magmas. Actually, we don't need to go home. We can go to the other side of Ember Valley. Especially from here. It's not that far. It's also not that far to go home, but then we have to go across the whole island. I could just die, but I have so much on me. And I don't want to have to go around the whole farm collecting stuff again. Okay. We're going across this way. Yes. We need two magma plorts. And I think they eat hen hens. So we should be stocked up enough to get two magma plorts. It's across this way. Oh. Oh. Give me all the hen hens. Thank you. Alright, uh, we are running. We are making progress. Don't need to go up there. We need to go back this way. Down here, across the prairies. To... Wait. I'm going the wrong way. We need to go this way. We need to not go across the prairies. We need to make a left. We need to go pretty much straight through here. And then take a left. I should have known that. Not that left. It's the next left. Come here. You're going on an adventure. You may get eaten at the end of the adventure, but hey, it's, it's all good, right? I still, apparently I'm not going the right way. Okay, I'm going to stand on that to get up here. I, I'm out of stamina. It's awkward. I hear the lucky somewhere. There it is. We don't need any, uh, oh, another treasure pod. They added so many treasure pods. A dash pad allows you to briefly sprint with zero energy cost. Oh, but that's something that you build and put down somewhere, right? We don't need that. That We already found that treasure. Oh, it's like another treasure? They put in so many. Okay. I need meat, right? Yeah. And tabbies like regular hens, don't they? Where did the... Where did the blorts go? Did you boom them away? Okay, that's all. We only needed two. We needed three before, and we thought we needed one. So we came back with one, and we needed two. More. I can math. Two plus one is three. We needed three. And we brought one. So we need two. I just confused myself, making it simpler to understand. Ooh, what's under here? A treasure, but we already found that treasure. Okay, are we headed the right way? Sort of. It makes it easier to get to that Gordo if we go from the sky, so we'll go this way. Uh, we need to go this, this way. This is the way. Yes. No. I'm so lost and confused, guys. This looks promising. What's this little light coming through right here? It's nothing. It's nothing. It's not promising at all. It promises nothing but disappointment. Okay, it's fine. Have we been all the way up here? I feel like... We tried, but we couldn't get all the way up here. No, we definitely were up here. Oh, guys. I'm lost. I I am very lost. What's over there? Oh, we've been... That's, that's our home island teleporter. Okay, is this where the Gordo was? Yes. It was this way. Uh, it was not. It was the other way. Oh, he's so hungry. It's because there's no chickens in this cave. Oh, there are. He's just not eating. He's being stubborn. Okay. So there's one up here, which I don't think I'll be able to... Oh, yeah, I can. Okay, there's one right here. 
bonk. No! Uh, that pillar is fake. Okay, good. He caught it. And then there's another one up this way. Come on. Come on. ASDF, you can move. You can move it. I don't even think I did an intro for this video. Should we do an intro for this video? I don't know. I think it's too late now. Where does this take us? To a little secret? Yeah, primordial oil. Let's go. We need so much of that for more energy. Azure glow shrooms. Always good to have shrooms. Pretty sure we could have entered this cave from right here. So there was no point whatsoever to getting those. Okay, where else could there be an entrance? To a teleporter. Do the intro at the end and then edit it to be at the beginning. I thought about it, but then it's like a weirdly disjointed thing. All right. Um, I'm stuck, Levi. I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need a more specific hint. I'm thinking probably either in these ruins or down in here. Maybe. Maybe I'll go down to the beach area over the top of this. Let's see. The ruins are right across here, right? I should have gotten full stamina for that. And I w it was interesting that there weren't there wasn't anything at the ruins before. They were just kind of over here. So maybe there's something here now. Ow. The rooster is standing on that rock. I'm not seeing anything here. Is there a hidden underbelly to the ruin? I mean, there's something down there. It's at the north part where the grass is bright green. Here? Near where the crystal gordo was. Oh, I guess I didn't look much around there. The Crystal Gordo was here. Or, yeah, it was here. Okay, I'll go back there. I thought... I thought we looked around that area already, but we clearly didn't. Alright, we'll go back that way. Can we take the high road up above everything? We probably can. Be the fast way there. Let's see. We need to go above the beach. I don't know if we can go above these rocks, but I'm going to try. Oh, it was worth coming up here. Look at all the primordial oil. Let's go. We need to go... Well, let's just go around the right way. I'm just going to mess it up if I try to get fancy. And then it's going to take five ever. Oh, Tars. Wait, one of them just... He just offed himself. I already dispatched all the TARS. What are you doing with the music? Okay, we're going the right way. There's a long way here. There better be a teleporter back home at the end of this thing. Okay, we're in the green grass area. That lucky guy is still over there. He's just kind of stuck around here. That's fine. Okay, Crystal Gorda was past all of this. Crystal Gorda was way high up, I believe. Yeah, Crystal Gorda was over through this way. I am pretty sure about that. Is that new? No, that's not new. 
Crystal Gordo, I think, was on this one. So let's just let's just see around here. I think there's anything. There's just rock behind the waterfall. Oh, it's so relaxing around here. There was another one here, I think. Oh, maybe this cave is new. Huh? Huh? Cave? No, wait, we were just in this cave. And it's not, it's not here. Okay. Is there... That waterfall might have something behind it. Let's check. Yep, that didn't fall down. Did it? I did not see a heartbeat fall down. Nope, that's death. It's, there's death in there. Uh, maybe we try from up above. Maybe that's the way. Well, that was disappointing. Come on. Up, up, up and away. Alright. This is where the Crystal Gordo was. Oh, it's because they were hitting this wall and deflecting. Oh, the sound change being behind the waterfall. Do you guys hear that? That's so cool. Alright, I'm totally stuck. I, I'm gonna have to really lean on Levi here as a, as a guide. Unless it's like around past this thing. Nah, there's nothing past that way. Or maybe down on the hill here. If it's down here, I'm gonna be so mad at myself. Okay, no, it's not. I'm not mad at myself. Yeah, you can just go ahead and tell me. I have no idea where this thing could even be. Boy, they said it was a secret. I, I didn't expect it to be this well hidden. You have to set your system clock to exactly midnight and then the teleporter appears magically. Behind a waterfall near where the Crystal Gordo was. Behind the big waterfall that I said looks like there could be a wa something behind the waterfall. This one? Really? Oh. Oh, it's up there, probably? Yeah, it is. Dang it. My gamer instincts don't lie. I should have trusted them. I was like, nah, I can't be back there. There's nothing back there. I see rocks past that. Come on. All right, all right. Yeah, okay. Makes total sense now. Oh, we need plorts. We need a magma plort. We need a bat plort, a tabby plort, and a magma plort. Okay, we can get all of those. Uh, don't need heartbeats. Let's see, the bat plorts are on this side of the island. The magma and tabbies are going to be on the other side. I don't know if I can fly all the way over there from here. I bet I can. Okay, so we're going to need, um, we don't need those because we're going to need to carry three. Oh, there's a tabby. Uh, we need a tabby and a boom. Wait, that, that was a bat and a, what? Where did the boom go? Come here, boom blort. Are those batty booms? Oh, that's perfect then. Give me your plorts. Give me poop the plorts. Did I get it? Did I did I do the thing? Oh, I'm full. Uh, awkward. Okay. You eat fruit too, huh? Everybody eat fruit. Okay, don't move. Don't move. Don't move. I need that. No. Phew. Got it. All right. We're good. We accidentally got the cave. Only appears. When someone says where it is, that would be so rude. Imagine. 
They have an AI thing that's listening to your microphone all the time. And they're waiting for you to say where it is before they show you. Oh, more primordial oil. Oh, I was going to say we don't have room, but we have a dedicated slot for primordial oil. What's that? Treasure we already found. All right. Okay, one last time. Here we go. Hi. Sorry, I got I got distracted. We have we have goals beyond our understanding. Well, how do you have goals beyond your own understanding? I don't know. I don't understand. JJ got unbanned from a Roblox game by using ChatGPT to write an essay since you were lazy. You wrote them an essay to unban you, but you used ChatGPT to do it. Oh my goodness. What a gamer moment. Yeah, wait, how do you get banned from Roblox? I forgot how much faster running is in this game than bunny hopping. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. So you kind of, but not really, need this pad to shoot you up into that cave. Use auto clicker to no clip? Wait, they made a game so bad you can no clip by using an auto? On auto clicker? And then they banned you for not making a game? Come on. Okay, there's one. There's two. And there's three. I don't need that. And if I need it, it'll be right there. Oh, that looks... That looks like I don't want to jump down there. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. <gasps> oh, look, guys. It's snowy. This is so cool. And they said they had real, like, destructible snow physics. Look at how the water changes when it's cold. Like, they actually programmed in cold-looking water. Ignore the fact that it's going through the walls. They programmed in cold water. This is so cool. <gasps> we found it, guys. We did it. It's snow cool. Ha. We did it! The Powderfall Bluffs. Look at our footprints. They're live footprints in the snow. This is so cool. Oh, new logs. Accessing, accessing gg.log. What an amazing discovery. This glacier wasn't even here when I first came to the island. I'm not sure how that's possible, so I'm sending out additional drones to collect more data. In the meantime, I'm going to see if this snow is as fun as the stories I read as a kid. There's no archive log in that one. Look at the snow bunnies! They're rolling around in the snow! This is so cool! Man, Monami Park really outdid themselves with the snow physics. Look at that, and the slime buries itself in there! Look at the deep footprints! Dude! This is amazing! Look at these trees! The whole thing is Aurora! I am amazed. This is so cool. There's there's lore. Yeah, a little bit. Um, this one is less lore, actually, because we don't really know. I'll take a gold port. We don't really need the money, but maybe I can put it in the refinery. There's going to be some upgrade that needs a gold port. You just know it. <gasps> this is so cool. What's that thing on the wall? Bubbles? There's bubbles coming out of the wall? You're the Slime Rancher 1 collector? Okay, we're looking for a map. They're usually like... in very high, obvious looking locations that you would find by default. Also, we're looking for sabers. Oh, so cool. I love this. I love this so much. Wow. Wow. You have it on PC, Xbox, and PS4, so which one's the best experience, then? I hear there's a new type of hen hen, too. Ooh, ooh, little secret, little secret back area here. I'm just hoping they didn't implement powdered snow from Minecraft, because that stuff is annoying. Does anybody like powdered snow in Minecraft? What was that? That was a sound. That was a new sound. I haven't heard that sound before. It was kind of like a whiny... What are you? <gasps> a saber slime! Let's go! 
Got them! They look like bunny slimes without the ears. They're so cute! They're so cute! Oh, I love this. You know I'm gonna fly out to that little island over there. I'm gonna see if there's a map up here, though. Nope. Oh. Should I fly out to that island over there? I don't know that I should. Can we even? Okay, we'll go. Nope. That's that's a mistake. That would have been a big mistake. I don't think we can make it. Xbox has big frame drops whenever you're at the ranch. That makes sense, because they do a lot of physics calculations to make Slime Rancher run. We can probably fly... Oh, there's the map. Always get the map, because that really helps. Wow. Oh, there's two maps. There's two sides to the island. There's another saber. I'm trying to get seven. But if I find the other one, because I think there were two new plort types. And then in the patch notes, they said it was a saber and something else. I didn't really pay attention. Um, and then they had a mystery one. Oh, little puddle plorts. They're so cute. Magmas chilling in the water? What? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, they sound so cute, though. It's going to be at the top of that for sure. Look at the snow particles in the air. I am so glad I have a 3080. <laughs> we have like 13 frames per second. We already have less than 60. You can see the artifacting happening. Oh, we barely made that. What are you? Are you the new type of chicken? Yeah, a thunder cluck. Your stony hen's great, 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 great grandma. <gasps> Diet meat, let's go. Okay, he needs 20 more because that was 30. So let's look around to see if we can get any more of these thunder clucks. I kind of doubt there's going to be any here. And I want to take them home um, to breed them. But he needs 20 more. So if we can get together... 20 hen hen. What is this? Oh, wait. A sun sap? Uh, I don't need the gold port. One sun sap. If you stare at it too long, it'll hurt your eyes. Oh, maybe this guy... Maybe this has a... A thunder cluck. Nope. Carrot. An odd onion. Okay. Okay, let's see here. Maybe... Oh, I heard I heard something pop out of the snow. Like daisies! I'm also looking for a map. I was kind of hoping there'd be a map up here. Look at the totem tower! That's so cute. Uh, map's definitely going to be up there. Look at how big this thing is. This is incredible. This is so, so, so cool. Look at these little glowy aurora mushroom things. All the foliage that doesn't really exist. That's probably a saber plort or something. Saber crystal largo. Yeah, there's the map. Okay. We got the map. Boom. So there's this big old cave in here that I want to explore, but I want to see on top of it first. It's usually if you're exploring, best to start at the top and go downward. Is that the teleporter we came in on? No, it's just really cool looking. Okay, there's another chicken. A perfect snowflake? What do we get rid of? The mint mangoes? Let's get rid of the mint mangoes. We don't need these. We're, we're getting all the new stuff right here. It's too bad you guys don't eat fruit. Oh, hey, hey, calm it down. Oh, I can get that guy. We got five now. Give us a thunder cluck. Nope, nope. Uh, get away from the chick. Okay, that's fine. Everything is fine. Death down this way. I was like, what are these? They're mint mangoes. And we, we threw them here. 
Okay, let's go in this cave and see what's in here. Whoa, it looks like I need glasses. Alright, it was super blurry for a second. Are, they, are these hot enough to burn? No, but they are so cool. Dude, what is this? What are those? Can I have those? Slime fossils? Wait, but we already have... Um, okay. We're gonna go feed these sea hens. To this big guy. And then we're gonna keep looking around in this cave, because there might be more chickens in there. Where are you, big guy? You're over here, right? He was over here, right? Oh, he's this way around. Okay, so I was, I was, I was headed the right way. Nope, that way's death. He was over the top. Okay, I guess we'll just keep looking for more chicken. What treasure? A frozen flame? So cool. All of this is amazing. Man, Monami, really, you guys outdid yourselves with this one. Spawn the chickens. Nope, oh, they must have all fallen down. Oh, more perfect snowflakes. Wait, snowball? There's so many things to collect. I can't even collect them all in one run. No chickens here either, huh? That looks like I'll die if I get in there. I hear something somewhere. Was it just more saber slimes? I'm I'm trying to listen for chickens. How am I going to get out of this cave? I didn't really think about that when I jumped into it. There's the slime fossils. What can I get rid of? Uh, these ones seem rarer than those ones. So I'm just gonna... Like, there are so many slime fossils in here. Okay, I didn't see any chickens. Is that chicken? No, I don't see any chickens. Tars are okay. I mean, they're not really, but... Of the things that are dangerous here... Are we walking underneath ice? What are you? Is that a hunter? Oh, it's a hunter. I thought it was a new type of invisible slime. And I was going to be like, that is so cool. This is so cool. I'm, I'm just saying the same thing over and over again. Oh, a treasure. Oh, well, now we have to go all the way around again. That's okay. The snow's bench. Bundle up and have some hot cocoa while relaxing on this cozy snow-dappled bench. Da dabbled? Dappled. Okay, I'm headed to the big guy. He, we fed him 30 so far, so we'll be at 32... With those sea hens, and then we'll be at 38 with the... Ooh, a treasure. Don't mind if I do. Ice cubed. Is it an art piece? Is it a miniature slime ziggurat? A saber slime scratching post? All of the above. And all of this can be yours for the low, low price of getting out to this snowy island and looking for treasures. Oh man, another cave. Oh, this is where we came from, right? Yeah, this is the entrance. Okay, so how did we accidentally find the map and the big guy right at the front? Like, it is not easy to get up to that guy. So, let's try again. Let's try getting up there. Let's, uh, let's calm these tars down a little, huh? Did I see another one? Yep, can't hide from me. Okay, a hen. Um, one hen is not better than two sea hens. Plunk. That's a snowball pile, not perfect snowflakes. 
And the snowballs seem a lot more common than the perfect snowflakes. So I'm going to keep my perfect snowflakes. Take this treasure. Okay, again, one roostro. Maybe there's some hens in the forest over here. What's that sound? Oh, nice. Another sun sap, which I presume to be a rare material. Makes sense that it's found on trees. Okay, I think big guy's up that way. Yeah. And then he's like up and around this whole little area here. Oh, there would have been chickens here if it was like daytime or something. Wow, we have so much to explore still. Okay, we, we were here before, and we didn't quite make it to him. So he's this- he's at the top of this. How did we get there before? We probably went up this way. Yeah, because I remember trying to jump to that one. We can jump up from here. And I see more perfect snowflakes up there too. Did you guys catch them? I'm trusting my gamer instincts now. I, I didn't trust them before, and, and we suffered because of it. Although the perfect snowflake I saw was like up there. Way up there. We'll get up there though. Wait, we, we need, we definitely do need to get all the way to the top of this because there's stuff up there. Okay, you are 32 now, 34, 36, 38. So we need 12 more hen slash meat food for that guy. Okay, we can get up onto this palm tree thing. Then we can get maybe over to somewhere here. Mm, not quite, okay. So there has to be- oh, you know what? This is a jump pad, I bet, that gets up to there. Or it's a teleporter home. It's one of those two. And I really don't want to have to not teleport home if there is a teleporter that goes to home. So we can probably get up to that one from maybe this palm tree. It looks like it's tall enough. Yeah, we can get there from here. As long as our jetpack has enough juice to get us there, we'll get there. I will take more perfect snowflakes. Thank you. We're doing real good on resource collection this time. Oh, there's a secret hidden cave here. Where even are we? We're in like the secret top layer of the cave. What are you? Oh, you guys look angry. Your bites probably hurt a lot and there's gotta be a secret up there. Okay, good. This is good. This is an undisturbed nest. He had 38, right? This is so, so cool. I am really, really loving this. Uh, probably a roundabout way to get this treasure, but I'll take it. A snowy teleporter. That's good. Ow, their bites do hurt a lot more than normal. They are saber tooth bites. Okay, we're still looking around to see if there's any more, uh, more hens, more hen hens. More perfect snowflakes? Okay. It says food type, none on it. I assumed it was a resource, but maybe it's a food for nothing? They make sounds. I didn't know that. SDF, you didn't know anything. That's, that is, you are correct. Nope. You're not ruining my day. Wow. Wow, we made it up here at least. There's a chickadoo.
I don't know if we can make it up even higher than this without that teleporter. Wait, what's... oh. Okay, so you need... he has 38 plus 6 is 44. 45? He needs 5 more. We can find 5 more. Right? We could do it. We could totally. 5 more hens. Or 3 more of the uh, super hens. 5 more. We got this. We totally got this. Were there any in the cave? I know there were spots for them to spawn. I didn't see any in the cave. So probably not. Oh, we already got that one? Hmm. If I were a chicken, where would I hang out to not get eaten? There's one. Okay, now we only need three more. See some snowflakes. If I were a chicken, I would hang out in the spaces there's no slimes to not get eaten. That's... That's the secret. Like here? No. Don't see any. There's another- Oh! Okay, okay. We need- We need one more. One more hen. And then we're done. Can we walk on this? I need to know. Oh! <gasps> We can walk on this. No way. I bet you these only show up at night. This is so cool. And that's how you collect this thing because during the day, this is just a chasm and I was wondering how to get down to this. Wow. There's the last 10. And just in case I did my math wrong, I'm collecting all these hens. Okay, and then we can go back up through here and see where this goes. This is amazing! Man! I am so stoked about this game. Does this go to the top? I think it did. We're at the... We're at the peak of this side, at least. Which, we've been here before, but that made it so much easier. Yeah, we're totally near the top now. Wow. I love the deep snow. Another hen. That guy pooped two plorts, which means he just ate one of those uh, saber, saber food hens. Alright, here we go. If this is a jump pad, I'm going to be disappointed now. Nah, I did the math right. Kaboom! I think it's a teleporter back, right? Oh, <laughs> teleporter somewhere. Oh, there's two teleporters to this island. Okay, so I'm glad we unlocked this one, because this one's easier to get to than this one, from the start at least. Wait a minute. If... This is one of the teleporters. Could we have just started by going here? Like, is there a reason we couldn't get to here before? Oh, we had to unlock it from that side because there was a Gordo on it. Uh, never mind. I am dumb. As you were. I saw this treasure pod. I wanted it. The mystery slime is the second one. You don't know what it is. Okay. Yeah, I only saw sabers there. So, there's definitely a mystery slime out there still. Alright, where are we headed? All the way around. Because I had to have that treasure. I did have to have the treasure. Okay, we don't need to bring anything back hen-wise. If there's primordial oil, I will stop and get it. Because we need tons of that for our upgrade. But I also want to see what else we need. There's primordial oil. I want to see what else we need for upgrades. Because we got another upgrade blueprint for the vac tank storage, I think. 
And if that gets us from 40, even if it gets us just to 50, that's a huge upgrade. Um, because it takes 50 to pop a Gordo. So if we can carry 50 in one slot instead of 50 in two slots, then that's a great upgrade. I expected there to be so many Tars in here. They're all getting along. They're not eating too much poop. When you eat too much poop, you turn into a tar. Remember that. This is this is life advice with ASDF. Don't eat poop or you tar. Alright, we're going the right way now. Wow, we need to put a shortcut teleporter for sure on the snowy island. I think I had potentially um, started crafting them or talked about it, but then didn't. Also, I'm a little blue in this whole episode. I I didn't adjust my white balance. I should have. We use this camera for our church live streams as well. And the lighting in that room is a lot different from the lighting in my studio. Because I control the lighting in my studio and we're renting from... All right, let's see. Yes. Uh, we're renting from a gym. Hopefully that entered the tank and didn't just uh, break. It might have just broken, which is would be a bummer. Oh! Almost died. It's fine. We're renting from a, uh, a school and we're using the gym, which they have a stage and everything set up there. So it, it is a good spot to be, but the lighting is a little tough to control. So... We have to adjust the white balance on the cameras to make everybody look okay on the live stream. And the lighting is just different from the lighting that I have here in the studio. So I always have to adjust it back and I forgot. My bad. We made it home. Okay, we need a spot for our sabers. Let me think for a second. We haven't done anything with this zone, so we could use this beach area as our new area. Although we only have the sabers, and we have one spot open in here. Sabers eat meat, I would like to combine them with a vegetable one. And then we also have a new chicken type, which I've been storing all the chickens in here. So, maybe we can just use this area. We'll use the beachy area as the new zone. We'll put some sabers over here. Oh, we have a silo and four chicken types. So let's move the silo. I just had it storing the nectar. And apparently roostros. But let's just destroy this. We don't need those roostros. Okay, and we're gonna put a corral we're gonna put a coop. Is there a new one? Pond. Incinerator silo. Okay, no, there's not a new one. And then we are going to purchase all of this. And then drop in. Oh no, we fed them all to the other thing. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. Nobody panic. Now this thing definitely said it was the Stony Hen's great, 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 great grandfather. So we're going to take some Stony Hens over to this zone. Wow, there's a lot of Briar Hens. We will slap down a saber thing with the auto collector and everything. Boom. Okay, let's do all the upgrades. I don't know if there's anything that we'll need for this. Okay, one for you, 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 one for you. Oops. Come on, eat it, eat it. It's right there. Go on. You are not good at eating. There you go. Okay. We're going to put the rest in the auto feeder. And we're going to set it to slow. And then we'll get some saber plorts. And we'll, we'll just drop these. We won't sell them. We're just going to drop them in the collector thing. So, yeah, that seems like it was a good uh, good first stream there. <laughs> Look at all these chickens. Holy moly. We even have the Roostro Collector for old Roostros. Just 
get all those old Roostros in here. Maybe it only collects one of each. No, there's two in there. Because I guess we can use the old Roostros as food for other uh, things. So we might end up moving one of the coops to the other zone so we can have it feed the old Roostros to the Sabres. But man, that was good progress for today. I want to go explore a bunch. I want to see what the snowballs do. I want to look at every inch of that new map. Okay. So what did we unlock? We unlocked... Oh, we're one away. We need wild honey too. But one away on the primordial oil for that one. It was the jetpack, right? So we need some radiant ore. We're going to need 20 wild honey. So we'll probably do a resource collector... Uh, resource run on Wednesday and uh, yeah I mean using less energy and more thrust would be amazing and having more power would be amazing and having more tank boost there's upgrades still out there there's two more that we haven't found so that's probably in the new zone or it might be prepared for the labyrinth but yeah we'll do we'll do some resource collection and it'll be a fun time. So thank you all for coming by the Slime Rancher 2 stream. We're getting back into it today. We're going to also be looking for the new slime. I don't know anything about the new slime. There's three. One was mentioned. One was mentioned. The sabers were mentioned. Another was mentioned. And then I don't know what the third one is. It was redacted. So they might have pulled it from the update. But thank you all for coming by. If you would like and subscribe, it would really help me out a ton. I would really appreciate it. It's one, two clicks for you. And uh, yeah, that's it, I guess. Uh, thank you for coming on by. And as always, I hope you have a great rest of your day. And I'll see you in the next one.